to young Americans of Arab origin. I believe in you, and I believe in your destiny. My name is Amani Wazwaz. Being part of Mosaics has enabled me to introduce a variety of different activities and a variety of different lessons that would help meet the aims and the spirit of the Building Bridges program. I spent time collecting poetry and samples of essays from a diverse voices of Muslim writers and Arab American writers, and I put them together. And I spent time with students practicing and memorizing the poetry and the essays together so that we can embody the voices of the different people who wrote these different poems and these different essays. I made my way to the counter, slowly. I really felt connected to the people that I was working with. Everything that we do in any culture, especially immigrant cultures, is that we try to make sure that people understand that we are human beings. You, that's right. I'm talking to you, not him, not her. I thought it was a wonderful, exhilarating experience and very liberating because you say, oh yeah, I can, I can do this. In his life, he neither wrote nor read. In his life, he didn't cut down a single tree. I have meant to invite you over to my heart. Do you like the tea with sugar? It felt like it was a, a long story being told through multiple viewpoints of both sorrow and joy. Some people might like to party to Princess like it was 1999. I party like it was 1491. They embodied the heart and soul of the person who wrote those words and to communicate them with so much feeling, so much emotion. My body is not your battleground. My hair is neither sacred you're cheap. Literature is very powerful. Performing that literature, heart and soul, in front of other people, you are now delivering the message to a, an audience that will come to understand as well too. So the message does not stay stuck just in the literature. Now you're spreading it to other people. Mm -hmm.